up guys got a pretty cool little video for you today I want to thank gunadapters.com our sponsor for providing this adapter here to show you this is the 12 gauge to 22 LR 8 inch rifled adapter you get these on gunadapters.com for those of you who don't know welcome to the channel but uh, I've been making videos on these for a little while now and what you do is you just drop it right into your single shot shotgun and it makes your shotgun all the more versatile by allowing you to shoot 22 LR they also have other calibers as well but what I did today is, as you can tell by the title of this video, is I went ahead and put this 8-inch rifled adapter up against a dedicated 22 lr rifle. I really wanted to show, because guys are asking, just how accurate are these and should I even bother with buying one? Uh, because they're buying them for survival situations to build a survival shotgun. Now, if it's not accurate, if you can't hit anything with it, you're not going to be doing much surviving now, are you? So I really want to show you guys just how accurate they can be because I've been shooting these for a while now. So I put it head to head against this Marlin 795. This is a very affordable firearm and uh, roughly about the same price as this adapter. The adapter is definitely cheaper. But uh, I got this uh, powered optic on here so I kept it at 3 power versus this uh, primary arms red dot that I put on here, 2 MOA. So, Vantage point or vantage already went to the uh, the powered optic, but this red dot ain't bad at all, and it held its ground out there just to bring out the most accuracy in this adapter, or to help me out anyway to be able to see what I'm doing out there. The results are very interesting, so without further ado, let's get to the video. All right, we'll go ahead and start off with the Marlin 795 again back here, 45 yards using CCI Blazer 40 grain lead round nose. Going to keep the zoom down to three power just to for fairness for the red dot but uh don't mind the background noise i got a truck getting corn dumped into it so all right let's get started got a camera down there set up down range for your viewing pleasure here we go All right. Looks good. Not bad. Go ahead and move on over to the uh, H&R with the 8-inch rifled gun adapters, 22LR. And see how well it fares on the right target. I believe that was five shots, right? I think it was five shots. We'll uh, start off with five shots on the right target. Let's go take a look. All right, so this is the Marlin 795. And uh, we'll just measure this with my finger real quick from a corner of that. We're looking at about an inch at 45 yards. If you discount that one right there, this one flyer here, looking at just about an inch and just a little over an inch at 45 yards with that flyer. Going over to the gun adapters, short lane gun adapters, 8 inch rifled adapter. You're looking at just about an inch as well. And we got one flyer out there as well, furthest away, making it just a little over an inch at 45 yards. And that ain't bad at all. Again, that's just an adapter through a shotgun. And uh, we put that up against a dedicated 22 LR rifle. Now again, this is me behind the wheel shooting here. I'm sure if we had somebody better out here shooting, we could probably get some better results. And I bet I might be able to tighten that up more if I put a powered optic on that shotgun. But I wanted to keep it simple with a red dot for uh, complete versatility with that shotgun. But that ain't bad at all. Let's stretch it back out to about 100 yards. All right, I'm sitting back here at about 100 yards now. Might be a little under 100. I haven't ranged it. Probably 90. Let's just say 90. And I'm going to send some rounds down there at the 8-inch steel target I have. And I don't know, just see if I can hit it. This is the only way I can clear the brush I have going on is to sit inside of my Jeep and lay down. 
All right. Seven ninety five first. So, you know, of course, no issue with the 795. Let's go ahead and send some rounds down there out of the gun adapters. All right. And again, that's kind of nice having that powered optic, optic looking out there. We'll see how it goes. Remember this one on the target was hitting a little lower lower right so we'll hold we're gonna hold a little different on it okay so if I hold to the upper left hand corner as I should because that's where it's hitting we got a hit out there let's say Send a couple more down there. All right. You just gotta know where to hold them. I guess my red dot could use, could use just a little bit more adjustment to get this nice and zero. Still a couple more. Yeah. Got a pretty Solid string going on out there. I'll send a couple more, just for good measure. As long as I hold it up to the upper left side. No problem. All right. Well, I think I've proved my point. If you're gonna get one of those gun adapters and you wanna take it a little more serious, get this eight inch one, highly accurate, even out here at 100 yards. No problem hitting an eight inch steel plate. Spin you around here, and give you an idea of what I'm looking at. Uh, you can't even see it, but right about there in the center is my 8 inch steel plate. So here are the groupings at 100 yards on that steel target. I don't know which ones are which but they all seem to be in about the same area. I shot a few shots earlier and they were shooting low left with the adapter. When I adjusted I started holding up here and every one of them hit so I'm assuming I was kinda shooting down low there. That ain't bad at all. You know again it's not a dedicated 22 LR rifle. And uh, on a, just a red red dot. All right, guys, that's all I got for you for right now. I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, I want to thank Gun Adapters for being our sponsor and sending out this 12 gauge to 22 LR 8 inch rifle adapter to show you guys. And uh, check back later on. We'll be doing some more testing with this adapter as well as others that they will be sending us to show you guys. So again, I want to thank them for being our sponsor. We also want to thank HD Targets for providing the targets out there. Uh, really helps with seeing what we're doing out there. Trust me, I know. Um, great targets, check them out. Got a link in the description box below for both good adapters and HD targets and as well as a couple other companies that help us out along the way. I want to provide you guys with a discount for uh, sticking with us for so long and being our subscribers. Again, wanna, if you guys want some information on this little build here that I'm doing, I'll have a video coming up here soon. And uh, I want to thank you guys for watching and thanks for all your support. And we'll catch you guys on the next video.